Okay, hey, Brian, thank you so much. Well, this week, VHC Health and Arlington County announced an exciting agreement. This is to expand mental health and rehabilitation services. VHC Health plans to purchase and transform close to six acres at Carlin Springs Road into an advanced rehab and behavioral health wellness center. So we want to talk a little bit about this. It's a joint project. So we welcome Katie Crystal, an Arlington County board member, as well as Melody Dickerson with Virginia Hospital Center. Ladies, thank you both for being here. Well, thank Thank you for having us. First of all, for people who live and know Arlington, where is this space exactly? This is on South Carlin Springs Road, known by many because it's really close to Carlin Springs Elementary School and of course to the much loved Nature Center right around the corner as well. Okay, and a sledding hill that yes. a lot of people in Arlington Very know important. about. <laughs> so tell me how common is, a, this is a big partnership between the county and Virginia Hospital Center. How common is this kind of partnership? And I'm sure it's something you guys are pretty excited about. We're very excited. I think this is, uh, this demonstrates the great collaboration that Virginia Hospital Center has with the Arlington community and how we can partner together to you know bring care to the residents who are at greatest need and there will ultimately be you said 122 beds in this facility so it can serve a lot of people what are you the most excited about who this will serve specifically in Arlington well I'm most excited for all the patients uh, we and at Virginia Hospital Center we do not have the space today uh, to take care of the mental health crisis and the substance abuse uh, patients that seek care um, the thing I'm most proud of with this project is the um, opportunity to bring our adolescent care into our service line. Um, that is a greatest need. Um, the media is very familiar with yeah. the with how that need is growing in our community, and so we'll be able to add 24 adolescent site beds and an intensive outpatient therapy program for those those young students. Yeah, that's something I know Arlington County is not immune from. We have seen major mental health substance abuse issues for our young people, and now the county will have a place targeted for them. That's absolutely right. There is almost no facet of the work that we do as government that isn't touched by this need, especially when it comes to our young people and of course it's been exacerbated by the tremendous pressures mm -hmm. and stresses associated with the pandemic. We have a youth risk behavior study that indicated as many as 14 percent of our young people have seriously considered suicide. Mm -hmm. This has huge consequences wow. for our public school system, for all of our youth serving and family serving functions as government. So to have the level of care that Virginia Hospital Center has always offered its patients brought to our young people, their families, and then exactly across the age spectrum is a wonderful opportunity. Absolutely, and I know part of this partnership, it is a joint effort here, is the county retains some of that space, not just for the beds and, and the treatment, but also the county will have it. What do you expect the county to do with, with the other areas there? Absolutely, there is such a perfect nexus between what is going to serve the interests of these patients and what's going to serve the broader Arlington community when it comes to preservation of natural resources, for having green space, respite, we use a term in Arlington, biophilia, right, the idea <laughs> of really bringing that nature-loving type of environment. So the opportunity for the community to access green space, natural resources at the same time, that that kind of access to nature can help with patients in their healing. It's an exciting overlap. Excellent. Well, both of you, thank you so much for taking time to talk to us about this. And I know it's a little ways out. We haven't even broken ground yet. So we're talking about 2025, yes. right, right? When people will see it. But but everything's running up and running now. We're really looking yes. forward to it. Yeah. Thank, thank you. you so much for joining us. And we'll be right back.